part two of the build we got a uh, ruger muzzle brake uh, that's the same one that they use on the ruger precision and the hawkeye long range target medium height vortex um, 30 millimeter rings and let's put them on okay so gun is safe bolt is out and take off the protector Put a little bit of gun oil. And then the nut. This, this makes it easy to clock. And then the brake. So we'll just lock it down, we'll time it and lock it down. So I just kind of eyeballed it and just locked it down. sure you you push forward so it's up against the log so when it recoils it'll be locked up against the front and uh, see so it can move around like that so you want to make sure it's forward like that so don't really need a muzzle brake for a 6.5 creed mark because it doesn't really recoil but um main reason i got it is um hopefully it'll, like i can get back on target faster and you know spot my shots easier and we'll see if it improves accuracy but i mean they use it on the ruger precision so it's supposed to work but i mean if the groups open up i'll take it off but um we'll try and see see what um what happens Okay, so an important measurement to take is the center line of the, the bore to the center line of the scope. So, it's about 1.99 inches, so about 2 inches. And this is a good way to do it. You take out the scope rings. These are like half and a half. So you just lay a flat um, straight edge and then take that measurement. The center line of the, this bore is right, right about where the ejection port on the bottom is roughly about the center line. So that's a good way to measure. And what you do is you take half of that distance. So it's 0.99, so about one inch. And what you do um, when you bore sight it, that, um, that half of this measurement uh, one inch in this case you um, make it um, the laser on the bore sider you want it about one inch below the bullseye at 25 yards and that'll put you uh, pretty close at 100 yards should get you on paper so 
got the wheeler leveling system here and leveled out the action so once you got the the action leveled you want to um, put the level on the barrel and uh, get that leveled so um, you're gonna remove this one put your scope on and then put this on top of your turret to level the scope and then um, just keep up keep track of this one make sure that one stays level and then level out your scope Okay, so what I do to set the eye relief is I just close my eyes and I put my uh, cheek on the stock and and then move it until it's right in line about there. Now I can level it. this level level it out just go evenly tighten it down and park it and just double check your levels make sure it stays good Looks good. So I got this reflective um, target for the bore side or so. And you just want to side it in a uh, one inch low at 25 yards and try to get the windage as dead on as you can because um, if it's a little off at 25 at 100 it's gonna be way off so just get the windage as dead on as you can okay shooting
<coughs> Drilling them. <laughs> I'm gonna try to go one mile. Yeah. yeah.